Hey guys, Coach B, back in Marino, coming to you from Fitness Inspiration Inc. in Memphis, Tennessee. So we're back with our latest Getting Your Mind Right Mental Rep video blog of the week. What is a Getting Your Mind Right Mental Rep? Well, glad you asked, so check it out. What we believe here is that we have to train and condition our internal self, you know, our mental, spiritual, and emotional self, as much as we train and condition ourselves by pumping it out in the gym and working our muscles. Because if we don't invest equal amounts and have that balance between physical and internal or external and internal, then we're always going to have that gap between where we are and where we want to be. All right. So that's what we mean by mental rep and why we do these videos. This week, I would like to share with you nine tips um, or attitudes that may help you have a healthy body image, that may help you be a little bit more body positive, all right? And if you're already body positive, awesome. Maybe there's something new here you could share with uh, your child um, or if you mentor somebody, all right? Because there are lots of people, boys, girls, men and women out there today who struggle when it comes to um, being positive about their body and enjoying and appreciating um, their uniqueness, all right? So check it out. Number one, decide how you wish to spend your energy. Should pursuing the perfect image occupy most of your time? Or would you rather connect and spend time with people and focus on the positive things in your life? All right, so should pursuing the perfect image occupy most of your time? Or would you rather enjoy you know, connecting with and the people and the positive things in your life? Number two, respect, nourish, and invest in your body but don't let it define you or define what you're capable of, of what you're doing. The way you look has nothing to do with who you are and what you're capable of. An example that I can think of, um, conversations I've had with individuals who have, who have this desire to uh, get, move up in their career or to pursue a passion, but you know, after thinking, um, about the others in that particular field or in that area um, and comparing their body types since their body looked different than the people in that expertise or in that industry or that particular um, area. They choose not to out of fear because they don't think they'd be capable of getting it or worthy. All right, So that's what I mean when I say not letting your body appearance Define who you are or what you're capable of because it has absolutely nothing to do with that. Nothing. Number three, expect normal, normal, appropriate weekly and monthly changes in your shape, size, weight, okay? It's going to happen. The weather affects it, hormones, it, it's just a normal part of the process. So keep that in mind and remember, it's okay. Number four. It is okay to go into the beauty shop every Friday and getting your nails done and buying stylish clothes makes you feel good. Totally awesome. Number five, accept that everybody is unique, all right? And that bodies come in a variety of beautiful shapes and sizes. It may sound kind of simple. There are a lot of people that struggle with this. So number five, accepting that everybody is unique. That means we're not supposed to look like our girlfriends, we're not supposed to necessarily look like the people on TV, we're not supposed to look like the people in the magazines, because everybody is unique. Number six, don't let others rule how you feel about your beauty or you. Don't give them the power, people. Don't let others rule. I don't care if it's your mother, your sister, your brother, your husband, your girlfriend, nobody can take that power from you. You are. You have complete control over how beautiful you feel and how you feel about yourself, all right? So don't let anybody rule or define how you feel about your beauty or yourself. It happens all the time. Number seven, you can go through life and enjoy your body or you can go through life feeling like you're stuck with this body. Think the idea of enjoying your body. It sounds really crazy to many people. Totally possible. So again, number seven, 
we have the power to choose. We can go through life and enjoy our body and everything about it, or we can go through life being unhappy with it and feeling like we're stuck with it. Number eight, whether you're bigger or smaller than you used to be, you are still an amazing and awesome freaking human being who deserves respect and love from yourself and from others. All right, one more time. Whether bigger or smaller, you are still an awesome human being who deserves to be loved and respected. Number nine, I think my favorite. The people around you may not understand why you don't bash your body because it seems like everybody else in the world is, why you're not dieting anymore, why you never did, why you threw the scale out or why you don't have one in your house, or why you appreciate your body, why you practice self-care, and why you love yourself unconditionally. And that's okay because they don't have to. The word self-care, the words unconditionally loving and embracing body makes many people feel uncomfortable. All right, number nine, the people around you may probably not, will never understand why you don't bash yourself. The muffin top, the lunch lady arms, okay? Why you don't have a scale or why you threw it out. Why you stopped dieting, why you haven't ever dieted or why you appreciate your body and why you love it unconditionally. And guess what? That's okay. They don't have to. They don't have to. Only you. All right, so those were the nine tips that may help improve your body image and help you be more body positive. Now, it's not easy for some folks, for many people, to develop that sort of um, a healthy relationship with their body and the way it feels. And there are professionals out there who can help with that, okay? So please, um, this isn't a black or white, you know, quick fix or nothing kind of thing. Know that there are professionals who specialize in helping with body image um, and that kind of stuff. So look out to them, they're in your area. They're great resources, which I'm gonna list in the text along with this video, all right? Thank you for tuning in. I appreciate your time. Would love to connect with you. So please look us up, Fitness Inspiration Inc. on Facebook. And our website is Believe It, Bring It, Achieve It dot com. Woo woo. See you next week. Between now and then, 100% best me and 